This video will introduce you to the education, training and employment opportunities at Her Majesty's Prison Camp Hill. Work has come a long way since inmates broke rocks in a quarry, although you can still sew mail bags. You don't have to sew by hand, that's a slow and rare skill. You will soon learn to use a sewing machine in textiles. Post office contracts keep both textile shops busy, making mail bags from canvas, polypropylene and nylon. Material is cut, stencil printed and sewn into bags for dispatch. The engineering shop can keep you busy and give you useful factory experience. New entrants often start by making fiberboard reception boxes. The shape is stamped out. Fold lines are pressed into the board and the fastenings are riveted in. These boxes are used to store inmates' personal property. From sheet metal, the metal workshop makes dustbins, funnels and tins for use in the kitchen. The engineering workshop at Camp Hill manufactures gates and fittings. These are made for Camp Hill and other prisons. The skills of cutting, turning, welding and finishing that you have just seen are used to make gates. These gates are for Gloucester Prison. Camp Hill Engineering Shop is flexible and can manufacture many components. The metal being cut and pressed into shape here is used in shelving. farm has a fine dairy herd. The farm offers hard but rewarding work for those who like to work with animals and have initiative. Between 80 and 100 Frisian cows graze on 130 acres, converting grass into good quality milk. The cows are milked in a herringbone parlour where they are fed extra cattle food. Milk from Camp Hill supplies all three island prisons it also supplies milk to the mainland for Winchester, Ford and Kingston prisons. The farm has won many show prizes. Heifer calves bred here are raised for milkers. The bull calves go off for sale at market. The pig breeding unit is well stocked with 70 sows and four boars. They are of the large white breed. Piglets stay with their mothers for about five weeks. After that time, they are cross-suckled and then weaned. By five months, these pigs will weigh around 185 pounds and be ready for market. Farming can be tough, especially in winter. Most men find the challenge very rewarding.
VTC welding teaches you skills that you can use in work when you leave prison. VTC stands for Vocational Training Course and here you will be trained for the welding trade. The qualification you can earn is a City and Guild Certificate. You learn metal preparation, brazing, gas welding, arc and TIG welding techniques. Camp Hill will teach you good workshop practice and training places a great emphasis on safety. The electronic wiring course will train you in techniques for wiring electronic components. This 16 week practical course leads to a skill certificate from the City and Guilds Board. You will learn wiring, soldering, how to read wiring diagrams and building electronic equipment. You will complete around 60 jobs over the course with seven main projects. This course trains you in the basics for future work in electronics and many successful trainees go on to learn electronic repairs. VTC Electronic Repairs course offers vocational training in Camp Hill's well-equipped workshop and leads to a City and Guilds certificate. You learn to service and repair televisions, videos and radio equipment. You will learn practical fault finding and electronic equipment servicing. CIT stands for Construction Industry Training. The CIT building course teaches the basic skills of construction and building site safety. Skills range from levelling and preparing footings, laying concrete, basic brickwork, pointing and the many and varied range of skills needed in building work. This includes the safe operation of building site equipment. Successful trainees are awarded skill certificates from the City and Guilds Board. This building course teaches many different skills. Here, bars are being prepared for concrete reinforcement. CIT bricklaying trains you in the various skills and methods needed for brick and block construction. Bonded walls, arches and pillars all feature in a trainee's work. Again, success is rewarded by a skill certificate. This piece of work is a sewer intercept chamber made by a trainee. To gain a skill certificate on the CIT painting and decorating course, various skills must be learnt. Painting techniques, 
and the preparation of surfaces for paint or paper. Paper hanging skills. Textured ceilings and wood preparation to ensure a high quality finish. Education offers all men the opportunity to develop their abilities. Forget school, education is part of the local college and all students are treated as adults. Computer studies and information technology is very popular and teaches the use of word processors, spreadsheets, database and desktop publishing. This course is particularly useful for those thinking of office work or of setting up their own business. You can brush up your reading, writing and arithmetic in the basic skills class or improve your academic skill in proficiency. Maths, as with other subjects, is taught up to GCSE and A-level standards for examinations. Business studies is a very good course for students who hope to work for themselves. The craft class enables students to develop their creative skills and it makes a break from academic study. Activities range from soft toys, plaster cast chessmen, and ornaments, sketching, calligraphy, and painting. <coughs> Cookery is always popular, and you do get the chance to sample your own work. Meal planning, food preparation, cooking and health are all included. Woodwork teaches carpentry skills and enables men to work on projects such as making rocking horses, coffee tables, picture frames and chess boards. It is also possible to tackle challenging projects such as this carved eagle. Teaching staff will help you to choose the subjects and courses that suit your own needs and interests. Study is not confined to the education block. Facilities are also available for cell studies and open learning. While you serve your time in prison, use this time wisely. The choice is yours. <laughs>